Hey everybody, Mark with the comics and I'm back. This time I got a small stack of books I ended up picking up this week. My uh, local comic shop ended up having a holiday dollar sale. So I picked up a small stack. So uh, interested in seeing what I got, stay tuned for that intro. All right, so welcome back. If you haven't already, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that bell notification so when I do put out some content, you get in timely fashion. Like I said, ended up picking just a small stack of books this week. Um, went to the comic shop just to see what they had for new comics this week. And um, ended up, you know, not finding anything I wanted. But um, talked to the shop owner and he said they were doing like some holiday sales. And then when they do the holiday sales, they had like, I don't know. 10 short boxes worth of um, dollar books. So I was like, all right, well, let me let me look to see what you have there. Um, looking for some holiday books, primarily, you know, holiday covers, snow covers, you know, Christmas covers, whatnot. And just seeing if they had any cool uh, cheap keys. You know, obviously with December, I like to pick up some of the holiday covers and I'm going to be, you know, going forward, going to be doing some shorts too, um, of just like random holiday covers. So uh, stay tuned for that as well. So uh, let's get into it. I spent, um, what did I spend? Nine bucks. So I, I bought six dollar books and then I bought um, a comic for the little guy. Uh, so uh, I'm going to show you what I got. And if there's any like significance or anything like that, I'll, I'll let you know. All right. So first book. There you go. Boom. This was actually the, uh, the big find I got there. This is Punisher issue number 102. And uh, this is uh, the classic, you know, bullseye cover. Um, this book actually goes for quite a bit. Uh, I'd probably say at least $20, $30, depending on condition. Uh, so that was a pretty, this was probably my, my, my big find there. So um, is that. Um, next book, we got Scroll Kill Crew number one. And uh, this was just a pretty cool cover. Um, there is like some minor spec involved in here. This is like the first team appearance of the Scroll Kill crew. Uh, there's a bunch of characters in here. Figured it's worth a shot as a spec play because of the upcoming uh, Secret Invasion series. So uh, why not for a dollar? Who knows? Um, next book ended up, this was one of the holiday books I got. This is Archie's. You know, Archie's always always do um, holiday covers. They usually do, you know, several, several throughout the holiday season. And um, I saw this one, this was pretty cool. Archie's Holiday Magic Special, issue number one. Um, it's a one shot, of course, you know, but I uh, figured it's a nice little cover. So this will be one of the upcoming books I do for the uh, spotlight. Um, next book. This was one of the books I've always wanted to pick up in the wild. They just never really, you know, seen it. And uh, it's a really cool team up between Marvel and DC. And uh, this is Uncanny X-Men and the New Teen Titans. Um, issue number one. I would say this came out in the 80s, if I'm not mistaken. But uh, yeah, definitely glad to um, pick this up. This is the uh, first crossover between X-Men and Teen Titans. And uh, this is also the first source wall. So... There you go. Um, we got two more books. This one I picked it up for the cover because it's got had you know that little holiday theme there with the snow and the um, characters fighting. It is a Valiant book, <laughs> so I, I laughed when I saw this. Eternal Warrior issue number nine, and surprisingly, I had no idea this was a a minor key, but this is like the uh, first book of Geomancer, which I'm assuming is that book there on the cover. Anyways, I got it for the cover either way. Um, and then the last book, which is a nice, it's a, it's a cool cover. I've seen this book in the, in the past many times, but um, it's the first time I've actually owned it. And uh, this is Kitty Pride and Wolverine, issue number one. This is a limited series. Um, obviously, it has that, you know, winter cover feel with that, you know, house there on the left, covered in snow. And then you see um, Kitty Pride there going through the, on the other side as well. To a different place so that was a really cool it's a classic cover um so uh those are my pickups of the week um so hopefully you guys enjoy that stay tuned to see some of these covers and upcoming um 
shorts for my holiday covers. So uh, until next time, Mark's with the comics. Out.